Welcome to another episode of Solitaire Quest. I'm the Blood Knight of the Old Republic of Bloodganistan. Like, share, and subscribe. And today, at this moment, at this time, I'm reviewing Justice League Dark Apocalypse War. So, yes. Ah, uh, fucking computer. Fucking computer. Fucking randomly turns off. While I'm doing a review. Of this, of this, of this, uh, Justice League animated movie. Randomly fucking turns off. Fucking computer. Folks. Fucking A. So, yeah. I don't know why, but fuck, fuck Microsoft. Apparently there's this feature called fucking meat now on my computer now, and, uh, and, and yeah, it wasn't there before, and it's just fucking randomly turns off while I'm doing shit. With no fucking warning or prompting. So, yeah. There's an original version of this review. I, you're not going to get back. You're not going to get... There's an original... There's a second version of this video, but the file's fucking corrupted. Fucking A. So I got to redo this. So yeah. So yeah, Justice League Dark Apocalypse War. Let's get into it, folks. Now that I've aired my computer problems to you, let us begin. So we got a nice quote at the beginning of this movie. Accept the things you can't change. change. Have the courage to change the things you can and have the wisdom to know the difference. We got Constantine and Zatanna in bed together in the Watchtower. Constantine joined the Justice League. Superman assembled a crew that has Lex Luthor on it. Superman gives them a lowdown. Superman's going on the offensive. Lex wants to send an army. Dark side hacks, cy hacks cyborgs, cybernetics, and knows what's going on. And yeah. I wrote down my notebook. Yeah, just use a cloaked house of mystery to drop off nukes at the power cores of Apocalypse. Literally, they could have just, they could have just had like a bunch of, they could have made up a whole bunch of briefcase nukes. Could have made a whole bunch of them. Could have had the Atom miniaturize the briefcase nukes. Have like a full room of briefcase nukes, just all miniaturized. Then have the Flash uh, run around, placing the briefcase nukes in places uh, all around Apocalypse, you know. How, how get the house of mystery to 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 teleport to apocalypse have it all in stealth mode have constantine stealth mode the house have him stealth out the briefcase nukes and the flash have the flash zip around apocalypse all stealthed out dropping off briefcase nukes that have been miniaturized have him do that everywhere and, uh, yeah, just watch the fireworks, folks. Watch the goddamn fucking fireworks. So, yeah. The shuttles get taken down. Earth isn't doing too good. John Constantine's trashed at a pub a few years later. Superman and Raven show up. Constantine says to them, find your own pub. John punches Superman, con and then constant, and then he, and then some parademons show up, and they, and the, the parademons get all magic. Etrigan and the demon is there, and we got, and we have uh, Constantine say this. So he let you live to wander about, demoralizing everyone. Impressive. And then yeah. Raven's forehead stone is acting up. John Constantine escaped the massacre that went down on Apocalypse. 
They go down to a broken London tower. Constantine wants, or uh, Constantine wants the lowdown. Parademons that are half, they're parademons that are half, they're half doomsday. Batman got put in an electric chair. John Constantine pieced the fuck out in the flashback. And uh, Dark Side sends a thing to Earth. Giant machine. Portal out all the lava from the core. And then Batman is in a fancy chair and he's a cyborg. John Constantine uses a locator spell to find Damian Wayne. Raven portal that portals them there. And at, res at the response that it would that John Constantine would said it would take ten hours to fire up the portal. Raven says, for fuck's sakes. They get there and assassins show up. Damien Wayne is the leader of a league of assassins. They fight the assassins. In a dream, in a, in, in Raven's headscape, Trigon is in chains and Raven is not doing too good. Etrigan the demon likes Damien Wayne. In flashback, the Teen Titans don't do too good. Nightwing isn't doing too good. They want Damien to get through to Batman. Raven portals them to prison where Lois is fighting Harley. Constantine says, break her face, Clark's wife. Lois convinces them by beating Harley to join their cause. Constantine apparently banged Killer Shark at some point in the past. And they don't have enough people to attack all three machines. Damien sees through the BS and thinks Darkseid is playing them. Darkseid goes to Oa. The House of Mystery kicked John Constantine out at some point in the past. John makes contact with Swamp Thing, points out that the machine is stealing the planet's core. So they have someone attacking the third core. Or the third machine, the suicide squad attacks the base. King, we have this quote from King Shark. King Shark is a shark. Paradoom straight up killing everyone. Lex shows up in a power armor. Raven rips him out of the suit. She says to him, no one will mourn you. The two other generators are still up. Luthor gives them some kryptonite weapons to fight the Paradooms. They beam themselves to Apocalypse and Constantine makes them invisible. See what I mean, folks? They could have just fucking made them. They could have just went, went invisible to Apocalypse in the House of Mystery. With a bunch of stealthed out, invisible, miniaturized briefcase nukes. The, the Flash could have just run around and put them all over Apocalypse. And just blow shit up, you know? And yeah, it, Oa isn't doing too good. And Lava gets beamed to Oa. Members of Justice League turned into cyborgs. Constantine's fighting a murder bot, Wonder Woman. from, Et And then Etrigan steps in. Constantine uses the lasso and Wonder Woman on Wonder Woman to break the control. Woman, Wonder Woman holds the other Cyborg Justice League members back. Suicide Squad is to hold the portal. Barry forced to power the generator. Constantine peers into Barry's mind. Constantine has a plan. I wrote down my no notebook. Why the hell isn't this live action? Raven destroys a laser corridor. Cyborg is dismantled. Constantine magics Cyborg. Releases him from control. Darkseid and Batman show up to Constantine. Batman says to him, Was drinking yourself to death not fast enough? Batman fights Damian Wayne. Kicks the shit out of Damian Wayne. We have a Vader moment with Batman. And he betrays Darkseid. Then Damian, G Damian Wayne gets laser beamed. Constantine releases Trigon. And then Trigon possesses Superman and then breaks Constantine's neck. Possessed Superman fights Darkseid. Lois dies and uh, that snaps Clark out of it. 
Superman returns and fights Darkseid and tricks and uh, kicks the shit out of him. Constantine sees Zatanna and they're in heaven. Constantine was the backup plan and Zatanna compels him to run. She compelled him to run. Constantine comes back. Bring Ra Raven brings Damian Wayne back. Heals him. Darkseid needs to be distracted and John and Raven release Trigon. Cyborg traps Apocalypse in another dimension. They return to Earth and Earth is fucked. Constantine says to the Flash, You know what you have to do, mate. Clear the board. Start again. And the Flash goes back in time. Raven and Davian Wayne kiss and the light engulfs them. So yeah, fun movie. Fun animated movie. But yeah, fun fact though. Fun fact. When Cyborg sent Apocalypse to another dimension, or as he says, nowhere, when, when he rigged the boob tube up, he actually sent he actually sent Apocalypse to the dimension where Blood Ganistan resides. And folks, I don't know if you've had to if you've ever if you've ever had to clean up uh if you ever I if you ever have to clean up uh a uh, molten factory planet molten pieces of a factory planet a new god a demon and all of the new gods uh all of his uh, fucking arch demons, or arch dooms, whatever, then yeah, you'll know. If you ever had to do that, folks, you'll know that it's one hell of a job, folks. You'll know that it's one hell of a job. And yeah, do you know how, yeah, I had to, that was, that was an, that was an unfun week. I had to, you know how much magic power it takes to make portals to Earths that you haven't done Mortal Kombat challenges, tournaments to? Do you know how many? Do you, you know you know how much magic power it takes to portal to Earths that you haven't been to, that you haven't challenged to Mortal Kombat, folks? Do you know? Just, you know how much magic power it takes, folks? It takes a lot of power, folks. It takes a shit ton of power. So I had to find... Well, yeah, I had to spend a whole week... A whole week going to alternate Earths... Finding... Finding, uh... Finding a bunch of Justice League... Versions of Justice League... And then pretty much throwing them at the problem, you know? I had to spend a whole week doing that. And you know what, folks? Uh, fun fact about kryptonite, folks. Fun fucking fact about kryptonite. Kryptonite... I, fun fact I learned about kryptonite. Kryptonite from one Earth... From an alternate Earth has no effect on Kryptonians from a different Earth. So, yeah, I had to... I, I literally... I had to... I, I literally... So all the Kryptonite, pretty much, that I have, you know, in my just-in-case vault, you know, folks, all the Kryptonite... You know, all the Kryptonite I have in my just-in-case vault. All of it was fucking useless against the, the fucking Paradooms, folks. And, yeah. Yeah, and you can't kill- you can't kill those motherfuckers- you can't kill those motherfuckers fast enough, folks. Just saying, yeah. You can't freeze and kill them fast enough. It was a shit show that I just had to fucking clean up. It was a shit show. A bunch of souls that, uh, I, a bunch of souls that I have here, that got, that, a bunch of damn souls that I have here, 
in Bloodganistan, they all got loose. Some of them got loose. It was just a complete mess, folks. It was just a complete mess. So yeah, I had to, I had to, I basically, I had to go to alter, I had to spend a shit ton of fucking magic energy to go to alternate Earths to find, to find versions of Superman that are powerful enough and versions of Justice League that are competent enough to, to not immediately get killed. And I had to send them, I had to send them to fight a new god, a demon, and all the trash that got sent to, to, to the dimension of blood, get, where, to the dimension where Bloodganistan resides. Folks, that's, I had to spend a week doing that. Fun fact, folks. Fun fucking fact. And I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure Trigon escaped. So if you're in another alternate universe and that, and you found... You, 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 if you find a, a, a demon Trigon, well, you're pretty much fucked there. I'm not helping you. I literally, I literally, I, I literally spent a week, I had to spend a week fucking cleaning up the mess that Apocalypse and his, and his factory world made when it crashed into, into Bloodganistan, folks. I literally had to do that. I literally had to clean all that shit up. And I had to expend a shitload of magic power to do it. Well, it wasn't a fun time. I I, I, I chewed out. I I chewed out. I went I went I went to an alternate. I went to the I went to that I went to that alternate universe with with Superman, who made that fucking stupid plan. A flash was there. I fucking shoot those assholes out. I had to. I had to. I was obligated to. I had to. I, 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 I had to send them. I had to send them. I had to send them to Bloodganistan with a bunch of other Justice Leagues to take on Darkseid and all those Paradooms and and that demon Trigon. It was. It was a. It was a shit show, folks. Spent a week. Uh, I had to spend a week doing that, and then the few, and then the, and then I had to, I had to spend a shitload of magic power to restore Blood Gun stand. I'm pr I'm pretty sure there, are, I'm pretty sure there are still pieces of that planet Apocalypse. I'm I'm pretty sure there are still pieces of that planet. In the cereal boxes, I'm still fucking pretty sure. I'm pretty, sh I'm 99% sure that there are that there are like pieces of the planet Apocalypse, because you know they they fucking fell. What, what big ass piece of Apocalypse literally fell into in a lot of the a lot of the locked the a lot of the cereal factories where we produce breakfast cereal and. Bloodganistan, all of them, uh, pretty much all of them got destroyed. I'm still finding pieces, pieces of that factory planet in my cereal, folks. It's not, it was not a fun day. And then finding out your kryptonite you have in your just-in-case vault doesn't fucking work against, per, up against, against the doomsday enhanced. Dark sides. Not not a fun not, not not a fun way to find out, folks. I have I have this like bitchin' ass bitchin' ass kryptonite armor fucking useless. Absolutely fucking useless. Fucking green and everything, folks. Green with red accents and highlights, you know. I'm the blood knight. And completely, that version of Kryptonite was completely fucking useless against those Paradooms, folks. I don't know what the fuck they make. I don't know what they fucking make Kryptonite out of. 
bow is completely fucking useless. Completely fucking useless against those fucking paradooms. And that fucking reminds me. I gotta go back in time. I gotta go back in time, folks. I gotta go back in time. I hate doing this, but I gotta go back in time. And I gotta, I gotta sue Jack Kirby because of what happened. Folks, there's no fucking way around it. I gotta go, I gotta go, I gotta go, I gotta go back in time and sue him for damages, folks. Otherwise, I lose street cred, folks, in the supernatural, in the supernatural world. I, I lose street cred. I lose street cred, folks. I gotta go back in time. I hate doing it. But I gotta sue Jack Kirby for damages. I know I'm not gonna. I know I'm gonna go back in time, and U.S. courts are gonna be like, ha 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 ha, fuck you. Yeah, I know. I know. I gotta go back in time. I gotta go. I gotta find Jack Kirby. I gotta issue him some papers because his fucking creation literally fucking fell onto my onto Blood Ganistan and fucking fuck shit up. I gotta. I gotta go back in time. I gotta go back in time. I gotta go back in time and like issue Jack Kirby some fucking papers because that fucking happened. And then I have to have no, I have to have the U.S. courts, the Supreme Courts, because fuck yeah. I'm 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 going I'm literally. I will lit I'll literally threaten the, the past version of Earth. I'm gonna, I'm gonna threaten the I'm gonna threaten the USA. I'm gonna take it to shit to the Supreme Court, and I have to go back in time. And yeah, I'm gonna get sh I'm gonna the Supreme Court's gonna be like ha 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 blah blah blah. It's gonna be it's gonna be an interesting time, folks. I gotta I gotta put that on my agenda. Don't like going back in time. And suing creators for damages caused by their works of art. But yeah. It's gotta be done, folks. It's gotta be done. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta go back in time and do that. It's not fun, folks. It's not fun, but I gotta do it. I've got to go back in time and issue Jack Kirby some uh, papers for damages his creations caused, or his creation caused, at, in Bloodganistan, folks. Then i got to go to the Supreme Court and get laughed out because of legal stuff. That's not, that's never fun. That is never fun, folks. Gotta go back in time and do that. So, yeah. So, yeah. There's not much to say about this movie. It's pretty good. I liked it. It's good stuff. We got John Constantine as, uh, a central protagonist, that's fine. So yeah. Anyway. Not much else to say. This this movie's pretty good. Got me ranting. Got me ranting and yeah. If you I I bought I bought the special Blu-ray edition that has like the tiny statue of Raven in it. It's got like a tiny statue of Raven in it. And, yeah, I've got the Blu-ray Special Edition that has that. So that's pretty cool. I still keep the Tiny Raven inside the, inside the box. Still keep it inside there, don't want to lose it. So, yeah. So, yeah, folks, make sure... 
make sure what you, you if you're gonna fight Kryptonians, make sure you got the right Kryptonian kryptonite for the job. So yeah, this is a fun movie. I liked it. Action packed. Go watch it. You'll be impressed. It's good stuff. So yeah. I'm the Blood Knight of the Old Republic of Bloodganistan. Like, share, and subscribe. Stay frosty. Stay sexy, San Diego. Get your jewels in one where you can. I'm a spaceman. Invest in GameStop. Support Gina. Peace out, folks. Peace out.